Imagine you were a trainer in the world of Pokemon, surrounded by gym leaders, organized crime, and 200 players trying to become the world champion. Will I survive with just my one life? Well, in the next few days, that'll be put to the test. Starting from day one, within this small little village I spawned in. Before I could get comfortable, some trainers decided that I was a target, so I had to run for my life. Hey guys! Oh I'm my god, it's Team Rocket! Oh my god, it's you again. After losing this crazed player, I started looking around in search for some Pokemon to beat up. Legally, of course. When I finally found one, I encountered another trainer. This one a bit nicer than the one that chased me. Yo, what's up? How's your guys' oh, Pokemon experience good, going? It's been going good. Look, look, look. I'm a level uh, 7, bro. Hey, hey, hey. I'm a level six. <laughs> Once he was a friend of mine from older events, I took him into my team, leaving me with a team of three trainers. Why is your gonna... penguin so ugly? Almost looks like you. Uh, bro, bro, I don't think you want that, bro. I have the I have the type advantage, bro. I don't want to get you out, bro. He only had a Piplup that's built like him in real life. Keep this, peep this, peep oh, this, oh. Starly. We looking, we looking. Yeah! Come on, Aye, come yo, on, come on. Starly. Can you oh, hear me? All right, let's, let's get out of here, bro. Let's, let's get out of here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting. What will Piplup do? Pound, baby. Piplup will pound. Starly used quick attack. Waiting. Can do here. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Him, what will Piplup do? Growl. Yeah. Growl. Piplup used growl. Starly used to tackle. Did you lose? Uh. <laughs> that would never be enough to beat a gym leader. There's around eight gym leaders in this region, which is the first step to becoming the strongest trainer here, known as the champion. That was my goal as well. So we started searching to level up and catch more of these Pokemon to get a stronger team going. This Pokemon event was based on Pokemon Platinum. So as in the beginning of the game, I headed to the lake. Me, I guess a player who wanted to not be in the trainer's team. I will get them soon. No, what are you, I will. What are you talking about, bro? <laughs> you looking at? Hmm. No, you're a goofy boy. Maybe you'll know about it later. He was acting really weird, so I decided to leave him alone. I, can I buy your information off you? Can I buy his Guess information? He what the heck? He could keep his weirdness to himself. Players were split up into two teams. Team Trainers and Team Galactic. Team Galactic's goal was to steal the world of its legendaries and be complete nuances to trainers like that Bream guy was to me. Let's, the other let's dude. keep training, hey, bro. I'm trying to get a Bidoof, to be honest. All right, come on. Get it. No, 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 chill. You're taking my Bidoof, bro. Hey, I caught my first Bidoof. I also caught a Bidoof and then a Starly. But the beaver with the oversized teeth was a low level and I had to consider leaving him for a higher leveled one. I might have to abandon my Bidoof for a level four Bidoof, bro. No, no, no. Train him up, bro. Bro, science weak, shows though. that with the power of friendship, with the power of friendship and love, bro, he can get stronger, bro. What do you think? Hey, what do you, you think, bro? What do you think? Listen, it's only one level. I mean, that's what I'm saying about it. Although I could still force it to beat other innocent Pokemon for EXP. That's what I kind of ended up doing until I got him to level 10. Seeing as we spent the last 10 minutes or so together, I decided to name him Bernard. Me and Bernard were going to the very top. Ready? I think we're strong enough to get to like the new areas. Let's heal up a bit. Hello. Oh, well, they took my agents. We should buy some, some more uh, pots in the market and then leave. Yo, what about this guy? What are these prices? I only got six. 60 pokey dollars. This guy's asking for 700. You know what, though? Okram's dumb rich, bruh. What? Yo, yeah. yo, hey, look away. Bang. It's all right. Oh, guy's a scam, bro. I don't trust them. Oh, Here, agents, you can have a super potion, yo, bro. Yo, yo, chill, Ooh. chill. No, actually, oh. chill. Please, come on, give me one. Here, oh, agents, please. take this too. Now that we both have a pretty decent team, we started heading towards the city to look for our first gym leader and get our first gym bag. You guys want to head to the gym like, together? Yes. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Jubilee City, which was our first city since the village we spawned in. As soon as we got here, some other trainers started to chase us. Let's fight get out of here, bro. Let's get out of here. Bro, fight me. Yeah, I don't want to fight, fight, fight you, bro. Bro, fight me! Damn, fight bro, me. it's you again! Fight me! Chill! Fight me right I can never catch a break these days, especially with the more that my Discord grows. There's just more players that want to chase me all the time. How do you heal your Pokeball? Pokey guys. <laughs> Yeah, you've never played Pokemon in your life. Okram headed to the Pokemon Center to heal his Pokemon, while me and Aweka began searching for the gym leader, who was nowhere to be found. Want to fight? That's when I got the taste of my first Pokemon battle. Fight a me. Level 14! And luckily for me, if my Pokemon faint, I die. So this is putting my own life on the line. Um, oh, damn! 
You probably got a water move too, bruh. Oh, no, I'm ruined. Despite my confidence, he absolutely demolished me. Luckily, he let me slide, forfeiting the fight, allowing me to escape without dying. It was only allowed during the grace period, which was going to end around the time we beat our second gym. But it made me have second thoughts about my team. We need to find the first gym leader. I don't I don't think we're strong enough for it. Or not. You just got 1v3. Yeah, we could level up a bit more. This was a new team that was formed, known as Team Rocket. Though it was not too accurate, to what goes on in Sinnoh, the players had the option to do whatever they wanted to in this Civ. Okay, okay, this is yeah, crazy. Bro. We found an area with level yeah, 29 Pokemon, all right? Team. Many gave me Pokemon. Great balls? I had uh -huh. some Pokeballs on me, bro. Peep. Peep. <laughs> Oh Shoot. my god. Weka caught a water type Pokemon named Floatzel, which looked really cool. But more importantly, it was three to four times the level our Pokemon was at. I was on, <laughs> he, he gave me he gave me 10 balls. The last Dude. one got it, bro. Dude, you hook wanna, me you up, bro. Hook me up. Hook me up. I have 17. Agents, that was we probably awesome. need to get no, great balls for that because they have a higher chance to Pokemon. catch Pokemon. So we went to the Pokemart to buy some Pokeballs, and hopefully I was able to get one for myself too. That would have been completely broken if I could get a hold of that. Oh, Weka! That's when Aweka found out about Bream. I missed you, buddy. What have you been up to, Bream? It's been a while since we... Well, actually, no. We saw you, like, in the last city, too. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, boy. Hold on. No, he I'm, didn't I'm find me. He ran away. He's let's scared. Go, Bream. I'm about to face you, Okay, watch, watch. Water pose, water pose. 34! Yeah, let's go! Go! Come on! <laughs> You're gonna lose! Hey, You're invincible, bro. You're invincible. You don't lose, bro. Remember that. What is this level difference, bro? <laughs> yeah, he's cheating. <laughs> I my fainted level, both my level. of his... Yo, Adrian! You have a level 30 I fainted I both of his Pokemon! Saw, <laughs> he was part of Team Rocket, but he still ended up losing. Though, not as embarrassingly as I did. Green forfeited on his end feeling cocky and told us that he'd be back with a bigger team. <laughs> Alright, well, look, before uh, we go okay. in, let me oh. tell you guys something. These are some scary Pokemon out here, alright? After a bit of searching, we managed to find a float soul, which Okram caught in one go. Here, you can have- Oh! Ah! Who is not please, catching please, that? Please, please, at please, 91%. Please, 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 please. <laughs> Meanwhile, I had quite a lot of trouble catching him. Missed. I'm starting to think he was the main character, and I'm just here. No way. Okram, Okram, start begging for me, bro. You got better luck. <laughs> Please, please. I'll give a you one, money, two, I'll give you fame, three, I'll give you power, I'll give four, you girls. No ah, it. My Starly is level 13 him. now for capturing him. Just for oh my god. I believe he hey, is. Mokram, you just picked up my ball. Mokram, can I give my ball back? You mean, Whoa, you mean, you mean what? my ball that I gave to you? Alright, fine. Can I just get it just back? Say, just say you want my balls, bro. Wait, <laughs> I'm gonna try to catch this one flying. No, I missed! Can I catch another Pokemon just in case? Yeah. yeah, there's a chitter chatter Ow, right here. What the hell? Out of nowhere. Yo, a Shinx just attacked me. But I do have to admit that he's pretty cute. I ended up deciding to catch him because the more Pokemon I had, the better chance I had against this upcoming gym. And at last, we arrived at Orboro City, ready to see what awaited us. We discovered a mining cave. What is like Zubats in here? No! Yo, wait, wait, yeah. I, I think it's this way. No, no. <laughs> You know where the first gym leader is? How does nobody know? Nope. Wait, 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 there's a gym match. Oh my god, is that Zane's? <laughs> Zane's, you made it! Bro, what bro, happened? You gonna I've never seen him without his glasses. He kind of looks stupid. It also had a museum which contained lots of armor and other goodies. A mining museum. Oh, damn. All right, we can maybe find him in here somewhere. After we left, we found the gym. Oh, I think this uh, is it. I yo, think this Tracy. Is it. And started fighting our way through it. I go first. I'm already, I'm already in a battle. Oh, oh, I'll show you guys how it's done, he's bro. Fighting, he's fighting the grunt right there. Oh my god. I'm dropping this boy. Was. Crunch, boy! Oh, a critical you got hit. Him. Damn. Did he faint? He fainted. Before we went to the gym, I had a friendly battle with another trainer named Firebone Crusher to test my strength of this gym, and he was smack talking me. And I absolutely destroyed him. Like, you guys should destroy the like button if you want more content like this. Oh my oh. god, my chim is evolving. Whoa, why Damn. is he so big? Oh my god. <laughs> Entering the gym, I easily cleared all the trainers and went to go fight the gym leader at last. Yeah. All right, come on. come on. Come on, come on, come on. Rock type? Wait, yo. You got this, bro. You got this. Hey, easy, bro. Light work. Oh, okay. 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 I'm faster, though. I'm faster, though. What? There's one more. There's only two. Hey, I got it. After another mining cave in which we fought some trainers for EXP, we headed towards the mining facility. 
A weird mining facility. Oh my god, is that an honor? Yeah, we're catching it. A trainer by the name of Mouse Guy said that there was a secret area under a bridge that had a honey tree. Yo, guys, come on, come under the bridge. Under the bridge? Yeah. Under the bridge. What's I under the bridge? Um, nah, bro, this is sketch. Kind of weird and suspect. I thought he was bringing me here to, like, kidnap me or something. But no, it was literally just a honey tree. There's a honey tree. It spawns a bunch of Pokemon. It spawns Pokemon like Apom. It spawns Munchlax and Heracross as well. Ooh, Munchlax. I want a I wanna Munchlax. On accident, we ran into another gym leader within the woods, thinking we found her gym. But in reality, it was a chateau by the side of a forest without realizing this had nothing to actually do with a gym at all. There's another path this way. Is this the gym? Is this the gym? Like I don't know. House? It wasn't alone though. It was an NPC that asked about some weird necklace thing. You found my grand mouther's necklace. I think it's a quest, bro. And with that, we enter. Whoa, what is happening in here? Wait, the evolved there's a haunter in here. It was creepy. Run down and had an eerie feeling to it with every step that we took. Is that a rotom? Are you gonna catch yo, it? Yo, blocks oh. are breaking, yo. Okram ended up finding a Rodham, which he decided to catch and add to his team. Not gonna lie, I was kind of jealous. Yo, yo I dead what? straight yeah, fell I through the floor. What are you talking about, dude? Are you dumb, bro? Did you not hear my yo, damage? Yo, yo. And the longer we stayed there, the more we realized things weren't what they seem. Yo, are you guys good? Yo, you weren't kidding about the block breaking. Is there anything down there? Rare candies. Nah, bro, the there's chest. some you weird the stuff going on in here. Madam. What was it? Millennium necklace duplicates all your draws. Added to that, we found the necklace that the girl in the front wanted at the attic. Oh, give it back to her. I will, I will. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Oh, what the? Hey, bro, I hate this house. Yo, wait, wait. Wait. We can't leave. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. wait can we fake? Yeah, we can, we can. Do this oh. house. Give the woman her necklace, wait. bro. Come on, come on. I don't know if I want to, though. It duplicates all my draws. The right. quest isn't going to do go it. Go over there. Yeah, you're Liar. Are you <laughs> Okram dropped the necklace and I stole it. I would say I felt bad, but he got the Rotoms. I wasn't going to leave the chateau without something that I gained as well. Good riddance though to that place. It was kind of creeping me out. Bro, how did we go from that creepy forest to here? Like that forest was so scary and then it's like so beautiful. It's so beautiful out here, bro. What the hell? Okay, you be like this, Oeka. I'm beautiful on the inside. Bald on the outside. <laughs> Now it was time for the gym leader of the city who would award us with a badge if we defeated her. This is Look, it. it's right here, bro. Oh, welcome to the second gym. We're all a bit stumped here, I'm gonna be honest. Hey. Oh, down oh. here, down here. What, what the hell? hell? Dude, this is kind of cool. All right, what is it? A Badoo? Easy, bro. Easy. What's next? Badoo? <laughs> What's next? Another Badoo? Easy, bro. Light work. Did you beat him up? Did you? Did you? Did you? Hmm? I am. <laughs> <laughs> this is the way. <laughs> I like this experience. Come on, baby. No, this is in the gym battle. The gym battle's oh upstairs. My. What? This is in the gym battle? This is oh, a train. Oh, 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 oh. Okram went first. Guys, I'm scared. Frontal? Who the hell is Frontal? Oh, that's oh, water, bro. Are <laughs> you getting clapped? Uh, no, no, I'm, I'm clapping not. back. Are you Who's serious? Okay, okay. Wait, oh my, what have y'all been doing? Ah! Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god. No, Wait, you're no, good. Use, a, use no, an electric. Use an electric move. No, I use a sidekick. Ah, let's go. Against all odds, I beat her. Nice. I almost lost, but he managed to pull through, obtaining the second gym badge. I went next. Let's do it. Let's do Don't it. Do Let's it. do it. Oh, I'm kind of low on my moves, though. Roserade? Is this shiny? All right, easy. 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 Come on. Leafy on? Flame wheel. Whoa. Oh, my God. What is that? Wait, is that a leaf type? No. Dude. No shot. I flame wheeled her entire team. Oh my god, I flame wheel your entire team. Oh my god. And getting awarded the gym badge as well. But for a Weka on the other hand. Wait, come on, no, you got the right. Come on, come on. Alright, we saw with pound! Turwig use razor leaf. Pipla faded. No, 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 This is a level seven. Wex. Doesn't matter. Oh no. Oh no. Onyx faded. Mr. Mime, Mr. Mime. Come on, Mr. Mime. That might be your only hope. That doesn't. Do damage. That's not a. Oh, no, 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 no. Have you ever played uh, anyways, Pokemon? Um, sucker punch! <laughs> yeah, dude, just sucker punch it to death. Yeah. I'm out of sucker punches. Are you serious? <laughs> you're, you're out of sucker punches. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna put my light screen back up. <laughs> what would that do? <laughs> oh, that bro, you're actually Go. cooked. She just said he didn't pass, bro. He was told that he wasn't worthy, but we all knew that already. Just look at him. Either way, we did what we came here for. Braided getting the badge and moved on, uncovering a criminal organization by accident. 
It says don't <laughs> trespass. Hey, okay, this guy works for me. Yeah, you guys we're stay back, okay? You guys stay over there. Phone. We stay over here. What is yeah. this building? It happened to be Team Galactic. We invaded their building and we found three Pokemon that they helped captive for experimentation. What the? Yo. The three Pokemon that were held captive were Cyndaquil, Rowlet, and Oshawott. Are you experimenting uh, on Pokemon? What the hell are you doing, bro? Well, they might look like normal Pokemon to you guys, but they're from the ancient Hisui uh, region. Why do you want them? Because I got the information on where the lake Pokemon are, which could get me the red chain. And from then, I can rule the world and make a new one. Oh, he's talking Wait, no, that's, that's for the future. About? Yeah, yeah. So, um... <clears throat> And uh, how are you, do you plan on ruling the world exactly? You know, with your uh, real, real Pokemon? I'm not gonna tell you everything. You're a cool Pokemon. Can, hey. can we get one? You're gonna have okay. to fight one of them first. Hey, who? Maybe I'll consider it. One who? of them too, over there. We freed the Pokemon and came across two members of Team Galactic. We had to fight a double battle for the first time. Hey, All right, hey. let's fight. Oh. Oh. Come here. No oh, okay, I guess. Okay, okay. Right. Come on, Oski. Leafage. <laughs> Oh, you have a fire type against my leaf. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Madoof. You're weak. Come out, Madoof. I know. No, Madoof. Oh my god! Come on. No, Geodude. Oh my god! How do you have that? After defeating them, I ended up capturing an Oshawott. What was strange, though, is that this Pokemon wasn't actually from this gen, but I'll take it nonetheless. As for Team Galactic, they booked. It. Team Galactic as a team had a set of quests, and I guess this was one of them. Wonder what their next quest required them to do and how far they'd go. This gave us time to explore the city and saw Eevee, the only Pokemon trainer to take down the sixth gym leader, Milky's Mega Evolved Gyarados. I mean, you go for that. Wait, too. Adrian's. But on the other side of the town, you? there were rumors that her and Okram had something going on back in their hometown, so we're kind of investigating it. She's right there. He's right here. All right, stop. <laughs> Whilst I was looking for more Pokemon to begin training, Okram decided to disappear for a while. Maybe he went to go find his non-existent girlfriend. I hope we see him again, though. I stumbled across a Weka who took me to these huge mountains. Oh, what have you been up to? We haven't seen you in a minute. So I ended up beating Tana. I'm gonna go back into the mines. I was literally in an OP area if you want to come with me. Really? But... Yeah, I'm down. I'm down. Let's explore. We use this time to train up our Pokemon in preparation for our next gym. Um, I mean, you know your way around this place. I know, bro. I've and I, I went on a five minute exploration arc and I'm already known around here. Whoa, okay. Oh, dude, it gets dangerous down here. If the Pokemon are higher level than you, they start Whoa. randomly attacking you. You're what are you evolving into? I can't cancel it. No. Dude, let him let him become let him change, bro. Bro. Okay. I miss my Bidoof. Nah, he's a Babero now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna get packed. Yep, one more, one more. And you're gone. Hey buddy. Look, you doing good? Hey man, I'm sure I'm sure things are gonna get better, man. Okay, don't who are you talking to? You. <laughs> Bro, I'm, I'm right next to you. <laughs> no, you're not. You're in the tube for me. Oh my god! <laughs> I think I you got glitched so it. Yeah. The second gym leader gave us a letter telling us where a special item was. Oweka and I went back to the starting cave, and sure enough, the door was open, basically begging us to come in. This cave was pretty huge. We followed it down and we obtained an EXP all. This item let us gain experience on all our Pokemon after a battle. This would help out a bunch. Saw some people with the third gym badge. I'm trying to get that. Yeah, gym badge. dude. We at last found where the next gym was going to be at. All we heard from there was screaming and trainers losing their lives to the gym leader. So in preparation, we knew we had to get a stronger team. Heading through the starting cave, we explored and realized that we wanted some ghost types to help us out. So we ran back to the chateau, knowing ghost types lived there, capturing a haunter, which I leveled up a lot. God damn it. Adrian's got the haunter. I'm trying catching it. Marco, start begging. Start begging, please. Oh, I got it. Oh, that's beautiful. That is beautiful. What? Like how much damage I do to other ghost types. We traveled back to the next gym and it turned out to be a ghost gym. Ooh, I made it. I made it. Wait, who's the, who's the gym leader? Is it Davido, bruh? What do you got? Your, <laughs> your thing's half dead. <laughs> the gym leader's Pokemon's half dead. Davido is the gym leader? Oh my god. Now, you know what? I'm bringing out the big guns. Uh, You're gone, buddy. You're gone. Yeah. <laughs> Did he win? Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? Bro, 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 bro. Yo, this is this is bad, y'all. This is bad. How do you get up there? I might be, bro. I might be. I ain't gonna hold you. Hello, Gengar. Oh, whoa, it is. Oh, I'm risking. I'm risking. 
Oh. Yes! Okay. Oh my God. I did, I did, I did. It was a very close matchup, but I pulled through and got my gym badge. That's when I also came across Eopoke on the rooftop of the gym. What's this deal you guys got for me? Anyway, I have a legendary Pokemon. Oh. Finding out that he had a legendary Pokemon, which was much stronger and much rarer than the normal Pokemon of this world. It was a Mew. I tried to trade him, but I had nothing to offer. But it wasn't all sad. Ooh. Hey, hey, you know what, though? As a sign of good faith, in case we need a team up at one point, here's some boots, bro. I ended up making him a new ally of ours. I didn't really want him as an enemy, seeing he had a Mew. On that same rooftop, I talked to Botch about the Lake Legendaries and how Team Galactic was fighting them. We had to save the Legendaries before all of Team Galactic could take them. The weird part was, Botch was on Team Galactic's side, or so I thought, but apparently he was spying on them. I also ended up talking to Aweka about the gym leader. I spoke to him how we both won and got our badges. However, I found out that Aweka had actually stolen the badge from the gym leader. There's a chest with a bunch of badges. I, j I just grabbed one and left. You know, and huh. here's the thing. Here's, here's the thing. Uh-huh. I might not have won. <laughs> and he did <laughs> faint did five out of my six Pokemon. Let's hope that the gym leaders don't gossip to each other like a council of angry teachers at a school. We were traveling to Veilstone City in search for the next gym and ended up finding Noski on the way. Oh, what? Look, look, look his skin. What? He evolved. <laughs> I also evolved my- Oh, oh my god. god. On our way there, we ended up finding this small little place, which I think was the Team Rocket hideout. That's where we found Bream and that larger team he was talking about. Looking at the middle, he had kidnapped player or Pokemon. I'm not really too sure. He had a Piplup skin. Sure, we could have helped out that little poor Piplup guy, but instead we valued our lives, so we ran. All right, we're not the best heroes. I know. After that, we located our missing friend Okram. He helps me evolve my Haunter into a Gengar, which makes me more powerful. After this, we headed to the gym, ready to take this place on. Wait, 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 wait. The highlight, not the highlight, the beacon. That's where the gym leader is. After a bit, I faced the gym leader. And with that, I won my third gym badge. Yeah, you won. It's a good day to be oh, living, y'all. It's a good day to be living. I found Oweka after traveling around for a little bit. Apparently, he didn't legitimately beat the gym leader again. Oh, you got him? You beat him? No. <laughs> He begged the gym leader to go easy on him, and they felt pity on him giving him the badge. What a loser. I decided to look past it though, because a badge is a badge, you feel me? And we eventually came across a lake. Remember Botch and Search that were spying on Team Galactic? They told us that the next quest for Team Galactic was to capture lake legendaries. So upon finding some of their goons outside of this lake, we pushed into the lake to see if this was true. It was the leader of Team Galactic, Ninza, who was stealing his second lake legendary. Oh, shoot. What the? Heck? And right before we could make our move, he captures the Pokemon before we can even do a single thing. We thought we were able to prevent the Team Galactic from furthering in any of their quests. We were so wrong. Botch realized things were getting out of hand. He knew that eventually he'd have to face Ninzai, not wanting to work with him anymore, knowing he had to kill Ninzai at some point for him to stop doing the quests and overpowering Team Galactic. At the end of the day, whoever gets a hold of the legendary Pokemon become one of the strongest. Ninzai only he had one legendary to go until he had caught all three lake legendaries. I have no idea how we were going to stop him. It felt impossible. Headed towards the north, which is where the third lake was located, to try and prevent him from getting the final lake legendary. That's when Botch informs us that the game this event's based on, the lake legendaries are used to summon two to three stronger legendaries on top of a mountain, which would make them basically invincible, which means that's probably what they were trying to do. This was bad. Uh, yeah. Yo, where do you keep going? What? Sorry, sorry. I recruited somebody to the Oweka team. The Oweka team? On our way heading to the lake, Oweka ends up getting a new teammate. Why? Do you think it sounds stupid? Yeah. DJ, show your excitement for joining the Oweka team. Yippee! See? <laughs> Hopefully they aren't as annoying as he was. Entering a snowy area. Okay, I don't really know how to go north. We gotta go this way. Maybe this Agents. way. Remember, I'm the guy who runs these parrots, all right? Have you ever you been here? You wanna know when you found me one day outside on the on the streets, bro? It was right out of here. This is where I was. Oh. Everyone made fun of me. The school bully. Me. <laughs> 
Yeah. Wait, oh, these are so cool. These are all really good. That snowbird turns into an abbas now. There were tons and tons of deep snow, which we could actually freeze in and die. So we had to be careful on where we went. Oh. Uh, uh, do you want some poke balls? Oh, shit. You have poke balls? Oh. oh. <laughs> Go, Machop. Oh. All throughout the place, there were really cool looking Pokemon. By far in Pokemon Platinum, ever since I played it when I was a kid, this was my favorite area. Simply because I just like snowy areas. Are you spam clicking? <laughs> this, this is the team you're on, bro. This is the team you're on. Noctowl. That's cool. All right. I'm going to be real with y'all. Oh, snap. Pokemon's evolving. Oh, it's about to be a Staraptor. Winter was my favorite season, so I was living this event to the fullest. They're gonna be a heal place in <laughs> Dude, I don't even know. This is where the lake's supposed to be. I don't see no lake. Go, oh, DJ, move. I'm moving. Can do this. I'm filming. I'm... Ooh, an item held by a Pokemon. Oh, um. Boost fighting type moves. Oh my God. Wait, we're near. I think oh. I see a healer place. All of my places are fainted. <laughs> Almost all of them are. <laughs> Not too long later, the snowy area led us to a place called Snowpoint City. This place was really frigid. It had a gym, ocean, lighthouse, and finally a lake. That's exactly what we were looking for. Damn, the Froliker. <laughs> Froliker, man. Oh, we didn't come here to waste no time. So we healed up our Pokemon and headed to that nearby lake. Ready for a fight. Okay, here it is, the beacon. Okay, get ready, because I think there's going to be a bunch of galactic people here. Try catching the legendary before them okay get your get your already, ultra ball out already. after finding the cave we jumped in i'm gh just running i'm just running i'm in i'm in i'm in i'm in hey ninzai mm, yeah. seeing ninzai close to catching the legendary lake pokemon we leaped forward mm, beat him to it beat him to it catch it catch it catch it oh. okram threw a pokeball at the legendary in attempts to catching it which caused them to end up fighting it we realized okram had betrayed us all the times that he was missing before he was plotting with team galactic against the trainers hence why ninzai wasn't worried about it at all because okram was now on his team despite the betrayal he was still our friend though and attempting to catch this legendary Pokemon, it overpowered him to the point where his entire team had fainted. Oh my god, Okram died because he lost? Yes. Killing him off once and for all. I wonder if he regretted double crossing us. With us being powerless against Ninzai, Botch even tried facing Ninzai in attempts to kill him right here and now. Oh, Ninzai, okay. listen! Okay, I don't fight. like you! Yeah, You've been underpaying me in everything! Oh, you paid me oh. one Pokemon card and That's it was cute. a slow bro! Oh my god, I'm dying! He too was killed. Allow Allowing Ninzai to catch the final Lake Guardian. All that was left was me and Oweka, but we knew our teams were too weak to face him. Come on, come on. It's wraps. It's wraps. <laughs> it's wraps. Book it, book it, book it, book it, book it. I'm not trying to get eliminated. It failed as trainers and as friends. But with the info Botch gave us before his death, he did tell us about what they were even getting the Lake Legendaries for. So we headed over there knowing the cords to that mountaintop that only Team Galactic's team should have known because of their quest line. We were some of the only players that knew about this. Damn, bro. All three of the legendary lake Pokemon are gone. Oh, we had one job, dude. Wait, we can talk to. Oh, Botch is dead. We can still, we can still take the, the main legendaries from them. Oh, really? How do we do that? We have to beat them to it. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. Uh, we need to go start training and get more balls. We climbed this treacherous mountain to chase after Ninza. We needed to stop him before we all died. He was too fast for us and we lost him. The coordinates did help, but it didn't tell us how to actually get to the top of the mountain. We couldn't just scale it like we would in normal Minecraft. So we kept looking around the caves and with the feeling of defeat on our shoulders, on our way back down the mountain, we came across a player named Nos. Yo. Oh, it's Nosky. It's the, the, oh, the Gary. <laughs> <this guy. laughs> Wait, where'd your friend go? Didn't you always have like a friend that you were sticking with? Oh yeah, Ninzai killed him. Ninzai killed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we all watched him die. Bye. Hey, you know what? We're looking for like the the place they they were headed to, where they're gonna get the taking the legendary. Oh, you know where it is? It was a friend of Botch's, and he wanted to help us kill Ninzai for revenge. You just you're just in like sadness. Are you grieving? What's going on? Okay, mister. I guess so. He turned emo. Since Noski was on Team Galactic, he led us to exactly how to get to that place. You think in this world that uh, sushi is made out of Magikarp? Yeah, you know. Like yeah. It would just make sense. Okay. Yeah, technically, I mean, I mean, yeah, no, I'd definitely be Magikarp. Yeah. Because they're just like also weak as hell. Ugly looking little things. <laughs> Don't you need like 50 of them to evolve into a freaking Gyarados, bro? You need to eat 50 Magikarp? You suck. This is a pathway. Man. You might actually be. Oh. 
Oh, and here we were. Just like in the game, we were on top of a mountain. And we found more Team Galactic members named Stag and Lamer. And at last, Tinzai. Lower, bro. Dude. So you guys are late. <laughs> Way too late. <laughs> So as you can see, your friend over there is uh, dead. As you can see, that's her body. These Pokemon already killed them. That's that's all with done money? and over with. He paid me a while ago because he had to deal with oh, me, but you know, kind of backstab him before he could do anything. So. Oh well, you got what but you anyways, wanted. But anyways, you guys you been interfering with my plans. But you'll be forgiven since this world will disappear soon and a new one will be made. I don't I don't think any of you guys are gonna stop me with this. Welcome Why? Back, back, back. It's time with the power of space and time to create a new world. And I don't think any of you guys can stop me. I'm gonna be completely real here. Fight him, fight so, him! Get yeah, him. I'm gonna start with this one. I ended up summoning all three Pokemon. Ialga, Akia, Garrett. Oh! I don't think he can catch it. Just look, I don't think he can catch it. Is he going to? After catching Palkia, which was the legendary that he wanted to take, he fell into that dimension ready to capture Garatina. It went in, it went in, the Pokemon went in. Wait, is this the end? Is this it, guys? We went after him, entering what's known as the Distortion World. Unknowing to what we would find in there, he jumped in. If I die, um, good luck. Are we gonna All jump? Right. Three, go. two, Three, one. two, one! Oh, this place is insane! Or even how to get out of here. We moved forward knowing we'd find at least one legendary Pokemon here for us to face. And I was ready to capture it. Yo, we have like, it's like a moon-like effect. It's like slow falling. Come on. I'm gonna be real with you. I don't know which direction to go to, but I see Pokemon over there. Can we can we use that to build up momentum? We can try. Who's going first? All right, you next. <laughs> She's dead. All right, come on. Oh no. Okay. Let's go. Jumped. All right. I hit the tree. You good? I did not hit the tree. Yeah. It's so vague on like what direct. Oh, there's a player. That's when we encountered some of the galactic goons trying to stop us. We can take him. It's slap man. It's slap. We can take him. I'm down. I'm down. I'm down. You down? Okay. Yo, slap man. Yo. Stag, stag, stag man. Slap. A wecker. Wait, can I fight him? Hey, let's beat him I up. I don't know if you can. Great. What's your average levels? Hey. Uh, 30. Yo, I'll take, the, I'll take this guy, I'll take this guy. Deciding between the two, I decided to fight Lamer, which honestly had a pretty weak team. Use this. Damn, did half? How much you do to me? Oh, one more, one more, one more. What? Oh, whatever, whatever. Okay. Oh. Come on, come on. All right, first Pokemon. What? <laughs> Why is this half dead? All right, nah, you know what? I don't even care, I don't even care. Don't, don't save my shop, don't save my shop. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, um, <laughs> now I'm one strikes. He's gonna get here. What have you been doing all this all this time? If you if you fight this, I might just have to bring out my ears. I think this should I mean, just oh not oh. Really. oh that's not even a bad Pokemon though. It's a bit low leveled. Oh my god. Okay. Damn, Damn it, you beat me. Oh wait. Oh yeah. It was nice knowing ah. you, man. Ah. Ah. Your, your Pokemon were act ah. oh uh Okay, that's one way to go. After the fight, he jumped off, eliminating him from this simulation. I checked in with Oweka's battle, and he was doubting himself, thinking he was gonna end this fight in a win. Hey, are you beating him? No, oh. I'm not beating him. <laughs> oh. I finally just got onto his second one. Yo, oh, let's go! Fainted his in a hit, bro. Pablo has gone! <laughs> oh, what you gonna do now, Stagman? Oh, you gonna send out Batman? You know what I'm gonna do to Batman? You... You both just don't affect each other. <laughs> I noticed somewhere near us that a player had a unique Greninja. It looked kind of emo, but you know what? All to their own. Damn. Hey, bro, we both you beat our fights. Something? Besides that throw off, it was finally time to see where this dimension had led us to. Yo, what the hell is that? Yeah, wait, can we use this as travel? Uh, do you want to travel there? To where? I mean, look where it leads. But there's another water chute. Do you see that? Yeah, it's like a sideways chute. Do we get in this water chute right here, you think? Uh, it looks sketch as hell. <laughs> go, go, go. I'm going, I'm going, dude. <laughs> After a weird water chute that went sideways. Yo, wait, this is different. This is different. This is way, way different. <laughs> okay. There he is. We found him. You want to fight him or do you want me to fight him? And that thing is... Yo, here. he's just waiting for us. That's so creepy. Yo, what's up, Ninzai? So you've made it here, huh? We meet again. As I've been waiting here, because I'm not gonna lie, I expected you guys to follow me. I've been talking with this Pokemon. For some reason, this Pokemon's been saying things to me. And we've been uh, exchanging uh, 
Now we talked to Noski Exchanging before. Exchanging philosophies. We we do not <laughs> agree at all, and it doesn't seem like it wants to come with me. So yeah, I don't know. I'm not gonna let you guys capture him though. You're gonna have to go through me first. I'm down. I'm down. Let's fight. There we go. God. All right then. If you have earthquake, I'm actually gonna just log off. Close I, combat. I don't have earthquake. Why am I telling you this, bruh? <laughs> Why did my infernape come out? What happened to my Bidoof? Agents, I don't know what's going on. I, do, I really don't. I, I'm, I'm cheering you on, though. Yo, don't push him to the void, bruh. Don't do that. <laughs> All right. Six HP. Oh, damn. Wait, Adrian, I just realized if you lose this, you die. I know, dude. Yeah. Oh, dude. Gyarados is about to fall to the void, bruh. Ain't no way, boy. Ain't no way, Come boy. on. Come on. Ain't Come no on. Hacked. What is this? Oh, that's like a last ditch effort type of move. I might be gone. I might be gone. I might be gone. No, no, no. Screw it. If your one's going down, my one's going down. All right, Adrians, come here. What? No, what? What? What the? What can I do against this guy? You know what? It's the Raptor. You've been a good Pokemon. But you gotta go. No. Yes. He will go. No. Yes. No, Adrian, Colbert, please don't die. No, Colbert. Hey, take, take a max revive. <laughs> no. Oh good my god, dude. Night and good trolling. riddance. You've got to, to be trolling, man. My god. Oh, this yeah. Job. Weavile, wake up. Oh, yeah. You know what? What happened to Crow? That happened to you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my god, bro. Oh, my god. I will not accept this. This will not end the way you think it will. Oh, my god. As I have this Pokemon Yo. right here on my side. Dragon breath. <laughs> It paralyzed and me. Inferno is paralyzed. <laughs> it's over, bro. It's over. It's actually over. No, no, oh, no. boy. Asians. Really talented little book, the hero? No. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. It might be oh, wrapped. Oh, I can't use Dragon Breath anymore. Ooh. Hey, Oweka, bro. Remember me, bro. Make it great for me, bro. Stop. Him, bro. Stop pushing him, bro. Stop pushing him, bro. Nah, nah. <laughs> He's actually going to die if you push him off, bro. Okay. Bro, how long okay. is he gonna be asleep for, bro? No, dude. Oweka, we might make it out of the trenches, bro. Are you serious? We might be, bro. Are you lying to me? Maybe. <laughs> no, I don't think Come so. On. Come on, dude. Come on. 17 HP. Oh my Boom. god, I got him, I got him. I got him. He's defeated. The fight was a really close call, and it was incredibly intense, but I won. Defeating Team Galactic as a whole. <laughs> yes! Oh my god. Yes! With my enemy defeated, at last I came across the legendary Pokemon, Garatina. All right, I'm fighting it, dude. I'm going to capture this one. So I screw it. I'm just going to use a Master Ball. Where is it? I ended up catching it with the Master Ball Nins I dropped to make sure that I actually caught it. I couldn't take any risks. And there we go. It's mine Are you now. Serious? Maybe we should retire. How about explain to me why you get always get the cool Pokemon and I get the underdog? Oweka was a bit bummed out because he wanted to catch it, but I got to it first. You got some back. Dude, I still have slow following. Do? Yo. Oh, I do too. Yo, yo, the oh. Other one. After finally returning home, we found oh. another legendary Pokemon called Dialga, where we found Ninzai originally. You want to get it? Ninzai didn't have. Actually, wait, I kind of want to get it. Yeah, yeah. No, yo, yo, chill, chill, <laughs> okay, chill, chill. Okay, okay. I wanted to catch that one too. Sure, I was a bit greedy, but it was a cool Pokemon. But Aweka took it from me. You captured Dialga! Let's go! With Aweka catching his own legendary Pokemon, we returned to the Pokemon Center to both heal and go into our PCs to put our nearly obtained legendary Pokemon on our team. I'm gonna see my legendary Pokemon. Hey, level I'll 70. Doof, we need to have a talk, buddy. Time. You're being sent to the army. Uh, it's, I'm done with you, bro. No, no but <laughs> look at the way he's looking at you. He's saying uh, no. He's begging. All right, all right, fine, fine, fine. You know what? You know what? Who, you know who I'm sending? This guy. He's not even supposed to be in this region. My dog is got drafted. Well, well, well. Oh my gosh, it's you. Exiting the Pokemon Center, we ended up running into Firebone Crusher again. Firebone, can we fight? Oh my God, dude, he's been to six gyms. Look at him. Damn. You want to okay. fight? Um, wait, wait, hold on. <laughs> I want to fight Firebone. Yeah, yeah, Firebone. Go, go. I, right. I've already beat him once. And he's been the loner that's been clowning us this entire time throughout cities. Oweka stood up for me, though, and decided to face him. I'm, I'm really weak. I only got like 20s. Oh my god, you fainted me so quick. Why do you still have a Hanta? We have 40 Hanta. We're getting packed, bro. Wait, you know if you <laughs> die here, right, you're bro. dead for good, no right? No more games. No more games, boy. Bro, games. what? <laughs> no, bro. Let's just nah, let's just get oh to the real. Let's what just the get to the meat, bro. <laughs> let's just get to the real meat, bro. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Yo, Let's just get to I'm it, bro. I'm tapping out, bro. This is too much for me. <laughs> oh my god. Only one tap. Oh my god. My man. This was a this was a fight you shouldn't have taken. <laughs> Any last words? <laughs> I'm a 70 Dialga. I hate Pokemon. <laughs> Killing off Firebone Crusher on this. He was on a high. I'm not gonna lie. I feel a little good right now. But Aweka was getting power hungry since he had Dialga backing him up. And he was getting annoyed at me for taking Garatina. Hey, hey, so hey, where are you going, buddy? What? Guess what, buddy? What? I run these streets. I what run you, this town. He just got here. Adrian's winner wins, loser dies. Are you serious? You want to fight? Yeah, yeah. So he faced me one on one, knowing that we could lose our lives at this point since the grace period was long over, meaning that we couldn't forfeit. We had to go through with the team. We had to go through with the battle until one person dies. And I accept it. All right. With Juve and <laughs> Oh, oh. All right, yo, chill. It's super effective. What? Yeah, bro. Yo, just because you take all the OP Pokemon, you always do this to me, bro. I'm done. Being Robin! Sucker punch, boy! Oh, wait, Hunter. why did I tell you? Oh, I forgot how this works. You don't run the streets no more! <laughs> I'm not Robin, I'm Batman! You are the sidekick! You are the sidekick to your own video! Yeah, Come on! Recoil damage. Hey, Adrian, remember at the beginning of this event? When I put you on with Flotzel? When I put you on with Flotzel? Remember that? You're not better just because you're bigger, buddy. That's not how it works here. Damn, why is your fossil <laughs> so small? Give it to me straight, bro. You want a grave or tombstone? What are we, what are nah, we talking about you here? Give it to me, bro. Give it to me. Where you want me to bury you? Back Damn. out? You think I buried behind the pokey shop? Damn. I didn't think it'd come down to this. You know what? I was going to bend him, but someone convinced me not to. We're putting you to work, buddy. <laughs> We're putting you to work. <laughs> ah, All right, bro. It's time. That should have been my Pokemon, but you said, oh, okay, you're Robin. Where you want the grave again, huh? Yeah, all right. 50. Oh. oh. Wait, I know why. Okay. All right. Now we're never, now we're never, now we're never. Come on, come on. Yes! That's your last Pokemon. <laughs> that was your last Pokemon. You're gone, buddy. You're gone. <laughs> Facing off against him, it was a hard battle. But with that, Oweka was eliminated. Leaving both my friends, Oweka and Okram, gone, I was now alone. Despite this, I pushed forward, knowing they'd want me to complete becoming a champion. Oh, where's the gym leader at? I'm lost as hell. Fifth gym. Yo, is this the fifth, fifth gym leader? I finally made my way over to the fifth gym, the water gym. The gym leader here was Milk, and we decided to fight. Yo, what's up? Hello, challenger. May the challenge begin. And you missed. I'm, all right. Level Ooh. 41. Okay. Yeah, I kind of mm -hmm. I kind of forgot to do the gyms. Do some aqua chat. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that your highest level? Yeah. I oh, missed. No. <laughs> all right. I got a plan. I'm a I'm a man with a plan. You see. Let's see it. Is that your last Pokemon? I don't even know. Yes, sir. All right. I'm gonna wrap it up then. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My Bidoof, right. bro. Dude, your Bidoof was so strong. I absolutely packed him. Bidoof and Garatina, the tag team goats, bro. And I got the water badge. One step closer to becoming the champion. Circling back to the start of the event, I went to the sixth gym. Gym leader? It's like a rock type, but I think I already did a rock type. Yo! The gym leader here was called Moxie. So I decided to challenge him for my next batch. Uh, do you mind me asking what your highest Pokemon level is? 60. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna go with this. I think you're a steel type. Well, I can't go wrong with my Bidoof, so. Hey, okay. Yeah, my Master Raptor has a <laughs> close combat. Oop, I did not look at the Pokemon I just sent out. <laughs> Onyx, are you for real? I can take you with this. I can it's take you with this. Water gun, now you're asleep. Yeah, water gun. He did not just pee on me. <laughs> Yeah, let's go. I absolutely cooked him. I'm Inferno and Bidoof went ham and carried me that fight. I'm telling you, Bernard is going a long way. He's actually one of my most goaded Pokemon. My strat is to put him to sleep. The next gym was located all the way back at Snowpoint City, one of my favorite cities in the game, where Ninzai also caught the last legendary Pokemon before I murked him. I think the next gym, like right around here somewhere. Making my way back over to Snowpoint City, I noticed something in the city that was blocked. 
blocked off. I kept that in mind for later and entered the gym. The leader of this gym was known as Vex. But before I fought her to get my seventh gym badge, she awarded me a Dynamax band. And she was going to use one too. I'm going to keep it a buck 50. I didn't play any of the generations that had the Dynamax band in it. So I had no idea how to use it. But I'll figure it out. This gym was the ice type gym, which should be fairly easy seeing as I have fighting types and fire types. Yo, well, I never I never got a rundown on how to use the Dynamax. <laughs> Is it this? Oh. Just click buttons, you know? Figure it out. You got it. Oh my oh, god. Me. Okay. What the <laughs> Yo, it's wraps. What the? <laughs> it's wraps. Oh, wow. Damn. Penny, wake up, please. Come on. Come <laughs> on, little baby. You can do it. And I'm gonna end it with a water gun. <laughs> Even with Dynamax, bruh. Why is he asleep? Because <laughs> of my Badoo. <laughs> Wait, that's it? You want your badge? Damn, yeah, yeah let me get it. Yeah, that's, you're, it's over. There you go. I completely demolished Vex with my newly found power of Dynamaxing. I was given the seventh gym. I can just feel the glory of the champion title in my hands. Here, I also reunited with Bream. Yeah, there's the gym that way. You see the beacon? Oh, yeah, I do. It was a bit more chill than when we first encountered him. Apparently, he too faced against Team Galactic, but his entire Team Rocket squad got wiped out. So instead of him trying to aggressively attack me as he did in the start, he too wanted to try his hand to be the champion. I guess he kind of turned a new leaf. We stuck together trying to find the 8th gym leader, since he was so lost out of his mind like Zoro. But instead of the city, we ended up finding a raid den. I had no idea how this stuff even works, but we were curious. Den. We can, get, we can get TMs. Yeah. Just right click it. I get up close. Right before we started the raid den, the second gym leader, Tana, ended up returning to help us out with this fight. And now you, you pick a Pokemon you want to use. Does levels matter? Uh, not that I can think. But if we die like all of us four times, or four Pokemon do, we lose. The raid boss was a Gyarados. It's a dragon type, though. What? Why did I get another raid? What is this? Exploring around, I found another raid den containing a legendary Pokemon called Reshiram. But it was from the wrong gen, but whatever. See, they ran oh, out. We couldn't end up catching it. But after cooking the Reshiram, I made my way to the eighth gym leader for my final gym badge. I entered the gym expecting the worst. The original gym leader came out of commission because he kind of got bored of waiting. So we had to leave. So his assistant replaced him. I didn't see it till now. Damn. I fought him expecting an easier challenge. I'm bringing out the big guns, all right? I hope you're ready for this. Oh, what are you going to do, bro? You'll see, man. You'll see. Boy, you killed my Garrett. Oh, Level shoot. 60, but barrel. You finally got a Gengar. Good Lord. I did. I did. I'm going to use this. I don't even know if it's effective. Damn, super effective. Okay. Oh, you're going for that? Oh, that's actually a broken combo. Good to know. Yay, give me my badge. At last, I beat him, earning my final gym badge. I've come so far. Now it's time for my final challenge. At the end of fighting all the gym leaders, there was a bigger challenge at hand, which was the Elite Four. The trainers I had to face to prove I was worthy of challenging the champion. Eagerly making my way to the Elite Four, I had to make my way through Victory Road. It wasn't too difficult. It was actually pretty easy, especially now that I had a level 70 legendary. Here I was at the Pokemon League, containing four of the most strongest trainers in the region and the champion of Sinnoh was here. Half of these trainers were NPCs, but the other half were players that stole the title from the NPC. Entering the iron door, I made it to the first Elite Four member. They specialize in bug type Pokemon. I only really had two counters to the bug types in my team, so this would be really tough for me. And so the fight began. Oh, we lit! We lit, okay. You flinched. Ice Fang again. Packed. Get out of here. Oh, crunch the damage, crunch the damage. Oh, he did damage to me. Hydro pump. Not going to be very effective, is it? Oh, I'm dead. All right, no, I got this. I got this, bro. Grapion got nothing against my Bebero, bro. All right, bam. Ground type. You're gone, buddy. You're gone. Ooh, not HP. Gengar, you're up. Hey, okay, one more, one more, one more. Shadow ball. Oh, shoot. Shadow ball. Yes, dude, yes! I just barely won the fight. It was a really tough battle, but I had determination. The second Elite Four member was a ground type. I had a lot of counters against it, so this should be easy. And the fight began. In this, what is this? I don't know, it's like a desert. This one's a bit stronger than the last one. Oh, shoot, water and electric. Close combat, come on. Packed! Whoa, okay, 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 close combat. Come on, come on, come on. Give it to me, give it to oh, Okay, never mind, damn. I can use... My water type abilities. Hydro pump, come on. Hey, let's get it, bruh. Hydro pump, I don't even care who it is. 
You're gone. Little did I know, the worst was about to come. The next Elite Four member was a fire type, and the trainer was Fuego Wave. Damn, but are you the are you the Elite Four? Of course. Fire time. You know, Fuego Wave. A hundred! Wait, why are you level 100? I can't beat that. Expecting his team to be really strong since he's a player that replaced the Elite Four, I started this fight with defeat in my mind. This could have been it. This was probably my deathbed. Oh, I can Okram, I'll see y'all soon, bruh. I don't even know, I bro. Fire type move do so much damage to the water type. It doesn't make sense. You play good. <laughs> okay. Okay. Wow. Okay. All right. Yeah. Holy oh, no, What? No <laughs> I somehow ended up defeating Fuego. His team was really strong. My toughest fight yet. Climbing the Elite Four, I made my way to the final Elite Four member, Ran. All right, Hello. Ran. Hello. <laughs> You're the last one, and then the, the champion. Yeah, good luck with that, by the way. This team has to be one of the strongest yet. Since he is the final Elite Four member. I'm still getting clapped by your level 100, bro. Okay, 70. Um, You blocked me from using it? All right, screw it. Water versus water moves. Could I heal? Am I allowed to heal during this? No, not during, but like after? Can, okay, yeah. so after each, each Elite Four, I can heal? Yeah. Oh, yeah, oh bro, I didn't know that. I was like... <laughs> One more, one more, one more. Come on, Floto. I'm scared, bro. Your level 100 is still there. That's the most I can really do is probably this. Helping hand. Damn, what? Damn. What? Damn. <laughs> the Pokemon sucked. <laughs> now let's let's be serious about this. Oh my god. What do I even do? <laughs> and one way to find out. Ooh. What? No. Oh, yep. Good game, good game, good game. As a as a reward, hey, come back, come back, come back. As a reward, here's a redstone torch. Damn, bro, am I the Jeez. first one here? Um, there may have been another one, but okay. This was definitely a hard fight. He had two legendaries in his team somehow. Luckily for me, I had one. Finally making my way to my last challenge. The champion of the Sinnoh region was Chase. Yo. Hello, Adrians. You the you the leader? I am. I've been waiting for you. <sighs> Have you? What level are your yes, Pokemon? I have. All max. I was way too weak to fight him. He offered me rare candies too, right before the match, so we actually had an even matching. Obviously, gotta level up the Bidoof. There's no way you actually went through with that. I did! But even then, I wasn't on par. I stood almost no chance against him. So with my Pokemon being a bit leveled up, I was ready for my hardest battle. Yes. Yeah, I'm ready. All right, let's do it. All right, Flutzel. Okay. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> okay, okay. Hey, I might, I might regret this, but is that a dragon type? Is it a dragon type? Dragon Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> what is this fight, bro? <laughs> yes. yes. What? Hey, screw it. Yes. Okay. <laughs> 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 a lot is not a number, Adrian. <laughs> My Bidoof, bro. I brought him from Route 1. I don't even know what's good against you. Yeah. I screw it. I'm just... Start clicking stuff. Who's faster? Oh, oh, oh wait. I'm faster. No. <laughs> that is not your strongest Pokemon, bro. <laughs> yes, it is, bro. Your Togepi is your strongest Pokemon, all right? <laughs> bro, you put me to sleep. Time. Wait, fire works? I tried fire before. What? Did you win? Yeah, I did. Adrian's won. I somehow ended up beating Chase, and he led me to the roof where I signed my name in a book. It's in here. In a hall of fame. Okay, write your name below. Put your victory into the official record and gain the title of champion. But do, I, do I put my name here? You gotta erase mine. I'm not the champion anymore. You are. Oh. Here you go. You forgot the... Uh, you did uppercase and then you forgot the other S. I, I assume that's supposed to be. Please? I assume that's supposed to be like um, a special effect in the book. But it's your like, exact Minecraft name. I, I can't change See it. See if that works. I signed it. Oh. <laughs> um, uh, you know. <laughs> okay, you won, bro. Congrats. Yeah. You're the champion now. I was now the champion of the Sinnoh region. It helped Botch, Okram, Oweka, and all those that have died in this Pokemon world. But remember the times we had that brought us here. Deciding that I had one last thing to do, I traveled back to my favorite city, No Point City. And finally entering the snow dungeon I had my eyes on since I first saw it. Apparently, there was a legendary Pokemon that could be found here. I decided to finally commit to what intrigued me earlier. Yo, what's up? I'm gonna uh, head inside that temple. I saw it like 
N no i talked with a random person who stood out here that led me inside the temple of Snowpoint city stepping foot into this unknown labyrinth it was an ice puzzle that we had to go across what the hell kind of establishment is this uh don't, don't look at me bro you're i'm following you I hope you know where you're going if we're going in a circle. <laughs> Making it through the first puzzle, we went down some stairs and found another ice puzzle. Hopefully this one isn't as long as the last one. At least it's not like sliding us though, right? That one had us going all around the room. Accomplishing the puzzles, we made it down a set of stairs. That's where I found him. My favorite legendary Pokemon was Garatina. And my second favorite was Regigigas. Oh, uh, what should I use against this guy? I'm gonna put him to sleep, actually. This is consistent. Okay, you do, you do a bit, you do a bit. Down a half house. Screw it. There he is. He's in my PC. Since I was the champion, I decided that it should be on my team. And I got it. That's all I really wanted at the end of the day, which was my two favorite legendary Pokemon. With me being the champion, catching legendaries, and setting up graves for all my dead friends that helped me get this far, I only had one thing left to do. Ever since I became the champion, someone kept an eye on me. The only way to get the title of champion is by defeating the last champion, which meant if anyone wanted the title, they'd have to defeat me. So a familiar face showed up one more time. Yeah. Yo, Oz, you title, again. Buddy. I've come to take your title, your Pokemon, fans, everything. Okay, you I mean you think you could take me? Well, I've been following you around this whole time. Oh, that's watching you. That's, that's kinda... writing notes, strategizing. Oh. All right, let's do it, man. You you've been chasing me since Still. the very freaking start, bro. Damn. I'm like a Pokemon, I've evolved. <laughs> Dude, that uh, that did not feel good. <laughs> You might be high level, but what's, what's hey, yours? let's see who's quicker. Well, good thing I have this electric type versus flying. Damn, bro. Bro, okay. Um, God. Killing me off and ending my life. If you guys want more content just like this, click here. Peace.